Hey guys, welcome back to another walkthrough video. This is the 2022 Shasta 18 FQ. For all our couples out there looking for a small lightweight, this is your trailer right here. One thing that is super nice about this is this guy is only 3,400 pounds dry weight. So that makes it super easy to tow with your bigger SUVs, even smaller trucks. Um, let's kind of check out the goodies on this guy. One thing really quick that we like to point out is in the new additions, they actually added a shelf in that front compartment. So that makes it nice if you want to put, you know, fishing poles, camping chairs, all that. You can secure it up there in the front, which is super awesome. Um, it also is a full pass through, which is super cool because then you can have as much storage in there. You can access it from both sides. It's super great. Um, this one does have the solar plug in on the outside as well. Uh, kind of like that uh, 21 CK review video we did earlier. Um, this is just like that one too. You can plug in right there. Cable satellite hookups right there. Here's your outside shower. Again, this does have hot and cold water options. So that is nice. You can uh, run hot water if you go, you know, go to the beach, you get all sandy or muddy. You want to wash off outside, but it is kind of cold. You don't have to have just cold water anymore, which is super awesome. Furnace vents. I do love where they put the shore power core uh, connection here too. So it's in the back of the unit, which is super awesome. Once again, newer campsites are putting all the electrical in the back of the campsite. When you, so when you guys uh, park or back up in, uh, you don't have to get a extension cord for your shore power cord. You can just plug in right here, which is super, super neat. They did that. I also want to point out just the look of it. The new look on these we have been in love with. I mean, the gray with the red and the white, it just looks super sleek, uh, super awesome. And it really brings out that uh, Shasta feel of the trailer that we love. Um, Again, so they like the outdoor entertainment. So one thing that they do set you up with is a massive awning. But I do want to point out back here, they do have the outside quick connect. So you can hook up a gas grill on the back too, which is super awesome. This one does not have the rack on the back, but that is an option you can add on later if you wanted to. Uh, to put kayaks, bikes, anything like that, you can add them on the back, which is pretty neat. Um, yeah, massive awning. It's all electric too. So you just hold the button down, it rolls out the awning. It's got the full LED light strip on there with the better wind arms on this guy. So you don't have to worry as much as the, uh, from the wind blowing them off, blowing the awning off. We just recommend if it does get windy, roll the, roll the awning in because that can ruin a vacation pretty fast. Um, but yeah, let's jump inside. So welcome to the inside. We're going to point out some of our favorite features. Also some of the greatest features that the Shasta and this 18 model brings to you. Um, so one thing that is super nice is you have dual side storage on this one. Um, unlike the, so the 18 BH is very similar, except you only have one side of storage, which is pretty nice on this one that you have both. This is a 60 or a 74 by 60 uh, mattress. So it is a little bit bigger than what you'll see in the standard 18, which is nice. So it still has plenty of room. Um, lots of storage underneath the bed and then also under your dinette there too. Um, just a great feature. It is great to have all the, all the storage under there. These guys did do the upgraded panel on this one too. Like I said, that's something you'll start seeing in these new 2022s. I love this. It's just a sleek look. It's super easy to use and you can Bluetooth connect to that and, uh, control that, um, from the phone, uh, do a lot of the lighting and such from that too. Um, let's talk about kitchen setup really quick. So this one's kind of a unique setup. You still get the dual, uh, stainless steel sink right there. Again, that's super nice. It doesn't scratch as easy. Um, and it cleans up extremely well. So this storage up here is pretty nice. You got a wallpaper right there. Um, it just looks, looks sleek. They did it up right. And then also the accents with this, uh, cabinetry looks awesome with the glass windows and the accents inside the glass. I was like, it looks, it looks nice, you know, um, this is pretty cool though. So you have the microwave in here. They did the convection microwave instead of putting another of, or putting an oven in. Some people like this option better because then you get a storage under there too, instead of the oven, but it does still come with that triple burner stove, which is super nice. One thing I love that they do on these stoves too, is they do a metal grate. 
that's super nice it just makes it so uh like when you're cooking and stuff you know uh it doesn't melt you know i've seen some that do like uh i don't know what it's called but like the filming on it will melt the metal doesn't and it cleans up really easy um so it's something like you would see in a house which is pretty awesome um over here is your entertainment side so you have the sound bar here tv will go here it is pre-wired for the king wi-fi setup uh, all your antenna booster and stuff is there. Lots of storage in here though. And that's about a half arm's lane deep. So that's nice. Um, just, you got some deep storages up here on these uh, cabinet storages, um, which again, it leads to that camping convenience thing. Uh, it just makes it extremely nice not to worry about where you're gonna store stuff. Lots of storage. You got storage under there too. And I love the new floor pattern that they did. It really blends well with the walls. Uh, you know, the accents, the uh, darker balance shades too, or accordion shades. It just looks really nice. It all pieces together uh, and just looks top notch. Let's talk about the fridge really quick. So this is that 11, seven cubic RV 12 volt refrigerator, high efficiency. This thing cools extremely fast and it has a lot less issues than a gas electric, which is super nice. Um, but let's look at that thickness on the door again. I mean, they're, they're heavily insulated too. So even when you're not using it, say you turn it on, you're going to travel, you want to tur turn it off to save that battery time, it'll keep your fridge cool for a longer time than one of those smaller, uh, smaller uh, or lo lower insulated fridge doors, which is awesome. So this is pretty cool back here. This is one of the biggest selling points of this is you actually have a full linen closet. Um, so that's pretty cool. And that's about uh, arm lanes deep. So you can put towels, uh, pretty much anything back there, um, which is awesome. And then you got the full storage under there too, which is about the same lane steep as the top one. So once again, this one's super nice for your longer travels. You got plenty of storage all around the coach. Uh, to load pretty much whatever you need to in in that which makes it i mean it's one less thing to stress about when you're about to leave is where you're going to put everything they got you covered on this because there's plenty of storage everywhere medicine cabinet there so you can load all your stuff in uh right there once again just makes it super nice and then this guy does that bigger shower as well so you could fit someone who's about six two to six four in here quite easily you don't have to worry about a height issue there. Thank you guys for another awesome walkthrough with me. DM us or uh, comment what you guys would love to see in other walkthrough videos. We're open to do anything uh, open to review or walk through just about anything as long as it's RV or camping related. Uh, shoot, even if it's not, send it our way and we can do some parts reviews or something down the road. Um, but yeah, just like, subscribe, comment, show us what you guys want to want to see in the near future um for now i'm gonna check out some more goodies on this guy so i appreciate you hanging out with me we'll see you on the next one